Welcome back, everybody. Nope, didn't mean to do that. Uh, I brought back a bunch of stuff. Brought back our our forge wagon, our little test trailer, and I brought this back because it's it's a bit problematic. I need something simpler. It's got too many windows and things that interferes with the um, with the front loader, and it's just it's just a pain. I, I don't need that. I don't need that. So I'm gonna sell all this stuff. We'll get that going. Won't be a ton of money, but it'll be something. And this little guy here. And this not so little guy. Let's get that repaired. Repainted. And we're at 42,000. I am going to do a couple of things. Uh, let's pick up a new tractor. Actually, do I need one right now? I kind of feel like I don't need one immediately. Let's hold off. Let's hold off on that. All right, jumping back, to, jumping back to town. And by town, I mean my farm. Okay, so where are we? Where are we? Um, few things. Few things. It's the end of the day. Where is my... What happened to my head? Uh, okay. Um, it's the end of the day. And I got all the grasses put in here. So it needs lime. It needs plowing. It needs rolling. And I did none of that. So it's kind of going to suck a little bit. I don't know if it's too late to uh, put in lime. I kind of forgot about that was distracted by other issues. Oh, I can't pick that up. Why can't I pick that up? Be able to pick everything up. We're super strengthening this episode. Okay, what is that, a bird? Yeah, that's a bird. All right, so I failed. I failed. That's okay, though. It's fine. It's just grass, so I'm not too concerned about it. Um... Okay, so we still have this dilemma, and I still owe the bank basically 8,500 liters of uh, of hay. So I need to get this transferred. So I'm going to do a trick. Um, let's start by transferring what we have. It'll take a few loads. The last load, or maybe the first load actually, just to get it. I'm gonna make sure I don't miss miss the opportunity. Um, I did reset my. I was having some problems with my store deliveries mod, so I did a reset on it, but I did not reset. I did a reset, but I did not reset it. So let's pick a better spot. Why don't we do it right here? Right here for now. There we go. Okay, and I think they go that way. So I think we'll be good for a while. I'm going to do... One of the reasons I wanted to do that is... Um, I am going to do a trick to get rid of one load. So that it's all fair, you know? I, I gave myself a free load of hay. Um for something that was my fault, so here's what we're going to do. All right, so there's, um, actually it's more, isn't it? Ugh. Okay, that's too much. I got to dump out, see if I can do this. I got to dump out about 4,000 of it. Trying to be fair on both sides of this coin. So, I don't know how fast this thing dumps. I hope it's, hope it's kind of slow. For now, anyway. Alright, let's see what happens. Uh, eight. There, close enough. Close enough. Um, yeah, I owe a little bit more than that, but that's okay. That, the, the other part's for my, my problems. So here's what we're going to do. I am now going to... There's the trailer. I'm going to reset it. And there it is, and it's empty, and I lost that hay, and therefore I'm kind of paid up, but I still owe a little bit. Anyways, 
Let's just call it. Let's just call it what it is. I'll try to try to be fair, but you know, if it gets too difficult, forget it. Okay. So I'm going to empty all of the hay uh, for the cows. That's going to be a few loads, so I'll probably probably jump cut this. We'll get it done. All right, 12,000, I've got about 90,000 in there, so it's going to be several trips. That's okay, though. Now I'm going to sell this, and we're going to look at, um, we're going to look at getting ourselves a wrapping baler. And then I've got to buy that header as well. So let's get this, let's get them as much food as this will take. Let's see, let's have a look real quick. Um, oh, it's not going to take that much, actually. Okay, that's that's fine. That's fine. I thought it was going to take a ton, but we're good. We're good. All right, let me jump. Let me get this done. I'll do a little bit of a jump cut here, and we'll uh, I'll be back in a in a second. All right, we're full. Let's get the rest into here. Taking me a little bit to get adjusted to what I really want to do on this series. So we'll, uh, yeah, we'll, uh, well, I know what I want to do as an end goal, but I'm just trying to figure out the steps in between, right? How much do we have left in there? Um, we don't have uh, 46. Actually, there's still some in the process. I can't get rid of that. all. Well, we'll do that last load in the morning, I guess. 46,000. So that's going to be three, three loads in a bit. I'll do three loads and then we'll we'll rest till tomorrow. And take it from there. Tomorrow we're gonna get fifty-five thousand for that building. Uh, we're probably gonna have some wood um, planks to sell. We're probably going to have some milk to sell. And we're allowed to go get another nugget. So we're going to do that for sure. All right. Last load. I mean, there's a bit more in there, but we'll, we'll finish up in the morning. You can see from the tire tracks, I may or may not have done a few trips. All right, that's it. Game over. Not okay, game over. What do we have in there? Uh, 54. But tomorrow, I think we're going to have two trailer fulls, which is fine. Okay, I'm just going to park here. And I really need a shed. I need a shed. Um, all right, let's rest up. And let's head into November. All right. More loan interests and... Ugh. Yuck. All right, 40,000. So, uh, let's get this finished. Then we'll go find a gold nugget. I want to get finished so I can sell that, that production. Uh, we'll get a nugget, then we'll do a little shopping. I forget how much that header that I need is. I think it's about 25,000 if I remember correctly, but I, I'm not 100% sure on that. What's our production doing? Okay, so it's out of grass. It'll obviously deactivate, and then we've got 7,000 to pick up afterwards. That'll be it. 
kind of an expensive beginner beginner production looks like we might be out of wood there that um that production does not go very fast that uh, little sawmill so we really kind of have a bit of a, a money problem um it's going to start to show up pretty soon as soon as we run out of gold nuggets to go gather Okay, let's go get the last 7,000. And then we shall, we shall get our 55. Yep, 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 yep. How are you guys doing today? Okay, there we go. Done, it's completely empty. See if the cows need more, may as well drop off what we can for the cows, right? I don't know how fast they're going to go through it. We're going to have to produce a lot. Now I need to develop a system because we do want to go real big on cattle. Like maybe thousands. Okay, uh, let's park out of the way, right here. Okay, let's get rid of this. Okay, 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 I say that a lot. There we go. Okay, we, we, we figured it out, I said okay again. Uh, we figured it out, uh, ultimately, you know, it had more to do with um, me not understanding or paying attention to the trailer types. There we go. And our yard is back. This here has a fair amount of wood. Uh, it's not producing very fast. Oh, I think it's they can only have two pallets at a time. Oh yeah, super strength. Something else should pop up, maybe. More planks. Oh, and we got some furniture. Okay. All right, so we're at 95,000. Let's go get a gold nugget. I think what I'll do... Um, where's the wood cell? I don't have a flat trailer, though. That's a problem. I kind of forgot about that. Um, where are we? Planks, train yard. Oh, train yard is going to be where we're going to be selling a lot of stuff. Furniture is 5,000. That's actually good money. Okay, uh, that cannot be converted. So I need another trailer as well. Ugh. Okay, let's buy a couple of things. Well, I can afford it. Um, mower category. Jump in here. Oops, I didn't want to jump in. I wanted to go to combinations. And this guy here is the one we want. 24.5. 140 horsepower, though. So, oh, actually, it's not a problem because it's not one of my tractors. So, customize. Uh, yeah, I don't know. I forget what we got. Doesn't matter. It's red. Okay, so that showed up here. Okay, so now we, we now have the two headers we need. So that's good. We got 70,000 left. And I need a flatbed trailer of sorts. So I think what I'll do... Um, should I get a... I kind of want to buy this trailer so that's not going to work as a, as a flatbed. Let's see. What else we got in here? Um, could go with, that's for a car. That's not what I want. I want low loader. I mean, I could go for my old trusty. I get it all the time. Um, let's see if there's anything different. 
I might just get that. This guy here, does this auto load? I don't think it does. Um, okay, you know what? You know what? I'm just doing it. I'm just doing it. 15,000. I'm down to 55,000 now. I got my header. I got my uh, trailer to pick up my goodies. Let's go get that stuff. And we'll head over to the train station. There's a, there is a couple more gold gold bricks over there. Old nuggets. We're just gonna take one, one per episode. Okay. Pick these up. And we'll just wait on the rest. There's gonna be a bit more. I'm guessing another four or five pallets. There we go. Okay. Now part of the challenge, I think, and I'm not sure about this, is I am now wondering if I need something to load my pallets. Do I have a front loader on this? I don't. Um... I don't think I have a front loader function on here. No, I don't. Okay, I might have a problem when I get there, because I think I have to load it up onto the truck. Oh, mind you, um, I can use super strength on this series, so I'll do that. Off we go. I don't know how much this is all going to sell for, but it should be a good... I don't know. I want to guess like uh, 30, 30,000 maybe. Yeah. Actually, maybe more than that. Maybe more than that. 30 to 35. That's my guess. It's going to be somewhere in there. Okay. I think I have to load them here, but... Uh, yeah. Okay, I'm gonna have to empty them manually. I'm stuck. I'm stuck. 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 There we go. Yeah. That's 30. Ooh, gonna be more than that. Fifty-five, right? No, well, that's pretty much spot on. Okay, there's one down there somewhere, and there's one over here. So let's go to this one. correctly it's down here somewhere there it is all right we're at 136 what we need now is a wrapping baler which is going to cost us a bundle ideally another tractor but i also want to buy some more land soon so i do need a second tractor though for sure for sure, for sure. Okay, let's shop. Let's shop this way. Any deals? Oh boy, look at that. Um, what is that? A cultivator. Uh, let's start with um, a wrapping baler. 84, geez. They're not cheap, are they? 
99. Oh my goodness, I wasn't expecting them to be this high. Uh, 96 for the Gawil, which I've never used. Uh, what else? Oh, I guess I could go for the cheesy one. Uh, we won't do that this time. We may end up with it later. Um, but no, I'm not, I'm not going to do that. 99. Okay. So I think I'm going to go with, I feel like I have to go with one of these. Messier or Fent. Yeah, I think that's going to work. Can I do all the sizes with this? Uh, 150. Is 150 the big ones? No, 180 is the big ones. So that's the problem with these ones. I need 150 horsepower for that. I need 140 for this. Hmm. 160. Uh, what should I buy? I feel like I might be making a mistake here. Um, what's this one? 78, 145. It only does 125. At least I can go to 150 with this. I think I'm going to do this. Um, we may upgrade later. Yeah, yeah, let's do that. Let's do that. Wrapper design. With on, with bail, with bail, with bail on end, on end turner. I think it really matters that much. Okay. My 84,000. Oh my goodness. Okay, we have 49,000 left. We're going to spend money. We're going to spend money. Um, see if I can get something cheap in the medium. 49, I don't know if I'll get anything half decent. This one here is cheap. 58, I can't afford that. Uh, 33, that guy's loud. Five for this 180 horsepower has no front connections at all. One seventy articulated gross. Mm. That's 50. I don't have enough. I don't have enough money. Okay, let's see if we can tough it out with that one for now. We'll have to figure out... Well, obviously next episode we can go get another nugget, but... Um, yeah, for now I'll have to do... I could jam more logs into that production. The problem is that production is really slow, so... It's maybe not worth it. Let's go check out the milk, see if we can do a milk delivery. I don't know how much there's going to be in there. That might be a few bucks. Okay, we're back. So I guess what I could do is run around with my new mower kit and get a few silage bales wrapped up. I don't know how many I could actually get, but um, that would be some money for tomorrow anyway. Okay, what do we have in here? 8,400. Okay, so I gotta go sell this. This, however, I think I have to go right up to the top of the map. So I'll wander over there and I'll be back in a few minutes. Well, in, a, in seconds, absolute seconds to you. All right, let's cut through this way.
Maybe it's a little bit shorter. Uh, I think I'm coming in here. Yep. Let's see how much money we get for this. Okay, so we got over $10,000 for this, which is really good. That's very nice. I, I'm still confused as to how, you know, beef cattle are still giving milk, but whatever, whatever. All right, back to the farm. Okay. So we returned, dropped that off. Now I'm going to, um, let's grab this guy and we're going to be doing silage. So we need this header. Let's see if we can pick up enough to get a couple of bales. Oh, I feel like we're not going to get much. Okay. You know what? Forget it. Forget it. Okay. Um, what are we doing? What are we doing? I guess the only other thing we can work on right now is uh, wood. So I'm going to pick up logs. And I don't know what I want to do with them. I can super strength them over, I think. I don't know where they went. That's kind of lame. Uh, where am I going? I was going to the, give it to the cows. Two stick. How much is each one of those worth? Oh, doesn't tell me how much they're worth. Okay, 60,000 left. I think we're going to hold on. Uh, what are we doing? What are we doing? Okay, I have a plan. I have a plan. We are going to spend some more money. Um, forestry equipment. I want a good log trailer. There's one in here somewhere that I like. This one. Takes good sized logs. 20,000. There we go. We're going to cut some trees. Uh, we'll obviously super strength them into the trailer, but I will not be running around with huge logs like a fool. This is a good sized trailer. As a matter of fact, this tractor is going to struggle with a full load, but that's okay. We're not going far. All right. So to get a measure, we're going to do this ish. Uh, where, why does my screen keep going away? I'm hitting a new key or something. Okay, I gotta take it from a bigger distance. It's about the right size. Right, move it up a little bit. There we go. 
Well, let's say we're gonna we're gonna cut these in three. I had to shove them out of the way because the uh, the seed drill kept tripping up on them. Okay. Looks a little tedious, but it's got to get done. I think I cut this one a little too long, actually. Yeah, a little bit, a little bit too long. That's okay, though. Actually, you know what? These can, you know, with little, little end there can hang off the back. Now, we're going to go sell some of this wood directly. That, um, that wood production is slow. Very slow. So I'm gonna sell some, I'm gonna, you know, drop some off there, but also go sell some directly. Because we need to get our money flowing. I can get this 20,000 back for this trailer, easy peasy. I'm just doing one run of these. Okay. Let me get these loaded up. I'll be back in a minute. Okay, that's all the logs that are down. Now we're going to cut some more trees. This is a huge one. Okay, this one might get cut in the floor. Maybe five. should do it. I think that's going to be a load, guys. I think that's going to be more than we can pull with that tractor. Where are we? It's not neatly packed like the way I would like it, but, but that's okay. I'm going to cut off that long end. I think it's just going to be a problem. Okay. And we'll throw that up top. Okay, that's going to be a load. I can probably put a lot more on there. Maybe a two, two more trees, maybe. I want to see how this does. It actually feels not too bad at all. We've got a whole bunch of trees ahead of us there that we need can take down. A few more over here. A couple on the side here, not many. Some uh, over. We still have a fair amount of trees to go. So uh, let's head to the store. Or the sell point, I guess, for lumber. See how much money we can make with a load like this. I don't seem to be having too much problems pulling this right now. Pretty stable too, doesn't want to tip. Which is always a good thing. 
guess is how much am I going to get for this? I'm guessing mm, 12,000, maybe. Wow, 18. Very nice. But we can make some progress with this. Let's take some from the other side now. Gonna add quite a bit to our field if we do that, right? Let's, I guess we'll start with the kind of the corner. All right. Okay. All right, I'm going to get a bunch of these down. I'll be back in a minute. All right, that's a bunch. That's a big bunch. So let's um, get these cut up a bit. We'll get them loaded up. I was thinking while I was doing this. Um, oops. Um... I think we're getting dairy from the cows. It's not based on the cows. I think it's based on the type of barn that we have them in. So basically, in reality, all cows are equal. It just depends what you put them in that matters. Does that make sense? So I should be looking for... I mean, you know, I'm not totally upset I'm getting milk out of this, but... Um, we really should be looking for a beef cattle fattening kind of uh, barn slash pen. That's probably the ideal setup for us. We'll get to that. This is very much the first pen, easy mode pen. And uh, we're just going to get into the groove of having the cows in the first place. Uh, needless to say, if I didn't want to go big, I need to get my mowing, my mowing game in shape. Well, as I was, um, I mentioned it a couple of times, uh, my wife runs a homesteading channel. Um, stuff that we do around here. I'm in there a little bit, but it's mostly her. Um, she does most of the content and I will join in occasionally, um, on Monday nights, she does live live streams, and that's going okay. I mean, it's just beginning, so there's only a few people listening. But um, I was pleasantly surprised to have one of you guys show up in that stream um, last Monday. Raz, longtime subscriber, one of the original subscribers for this channel, um, dropped in. Spent a little time. It was really cool. <laughs> um, it was hard to not start talking farm sim, but yeah. It was, it was nice. It was very nice. I am going to... Um, I kind of have big plans for for YouTube now. I, I, I really enjoy it. When I say big plans, I mean big dreams, ideas kind of thing. Um before I started a YouTube channel for Farm Sim, I was doing uh, outdoor, uh, mainly kind of uh, backcountry camping stuff. I, I am a I am a backcountry canoe camper, and I do spend some time out there. Last year I did not. I had some physical issues. Uh, those of you who watched my my uh, episodes. Throughout the summer, knew that I was uh, struggling through a few things, but uh, this year I'm feeling a lot better. So I'll probably get back out there 
and which probably means I'll revive my channel because I haven't really done much there. Um, you know, as far as content, it's been dormant a little bit. So there's that. And um, I also, I also am going to start working on my other gaming channel. Oh boy, what did I do there? It was silly. Um, which has been renamed a couple of times. I just have, have having problems getting a vision on it. Um, but ultimately it's going to be called Crest 2 Adventures. This channel is going to get renamed to Crest 2 Farming, just to make sure that it's kind of clear which one is which. So I'll do a, a rebranding. We'll, we'll call it a rebranding with that um, over the next month or two. And and then work a little bit on the other one. Now, truth is, with, with the homestead and with the backcountry camping, I'm going to have less and less time this summer, so I don't really know where I'm going with this thing. Um, I'm, I'm, I feel like I might be taking on more stuff than I can actually handle for starting this year, but we'll see. I think there's a couple of you that are into the um, other other channel, Crest 2 Adventures. It was originally called Crest 2 MMO, and then I kind of felt like it was a little too much Crest 2, so I changed the name to uh, Old Adventures or something like that. Um, but uh, I, I kind of missed the fact that it was part of the Crest 2 family. So we'll do that. We'll change that up. I'm stuck. I'm stuck. Uh oh. Okay. Yeah, I guess I can do that. Rusty Gaming will be the name of the uh, overarching kind of. Uh, I don't know what you call that. Umbrella. Umbrella. You know, that'll be the email for everything. That'll be eventually maybe a website. So we'll see. But I'm enjoying this. I'm enjoying the, enjoying the concept that I may be able to do something uh, post retirement with the channel. Not not necessarily to earn, you know, a salary or anything like that, but um, I think I mentioned it in one of the previous episodes. I forget which series. Uh, something that will get me one bill paid. You know what I mean? Um, because when you retire, that stuff kind of starts to matter a lot more. But I'm not there yet. But it's, you know, it's one of those things that doesn't happen overnight, right? So I am almost at 1,300 subs. Uh, and that's fantastic. That's really awesome. Um, there's been, you know, chatting, I want to call it organic channel growth. Uh, for people just are stumbling across the channel and, and are uh, interested in it. Uh, but I'm also getting a little bit from that uh, Comlands uh, 200 horsepower challenge. Uh, new people just uh, kind of showing up. So, so that's good. Oops. I will, uh, I want to try streaming. I, I know it's going to be really challenging with my, my rural internet, but I'm going to give it a try. I've been studying on, you know, settings and how to do, how to, how to do that with a challenging internet connection. And, uh, so I'm not sure when that's going to happen, but I'll have to figure it out. Probably within the next month or so, I'll give it a I'll give it a try. Might might have like a kind of a pilot <laughs> pilot episode of something, and uh, that yeah, we'll see how that goes. All right, I think that's kind of all I can handle. Let's head out. This is a bigger load than the last one, so I think we're going to be pushing much much higher than eighteen. 
This is a good trailer though. Nice and wide, long. But apparently I can pull it with a hundred and, what, what is this, 130 horsepower trailer? Not a tractor? Off we go. This actually looks like I could actually fit another tree or two on here. Okay. Turn. Nice and wide this time. Okay, what are we getting for this? Guesses? 23. 25. I love that I'm under guessing. Well, that's not bad. It takes us to takes us to 82. All right, I think we're going to take a little break with this, but I am going to continue working uh, over here at some point. We can go as far as about here. Let's park this nice and straight like this. Then we can see where we are. Okay, so we got quite a few here still, which is good. These are the these are the jumbo ones, I think. Awesome, majestic trees. Look how. All those things are um, okay so next plans I think what we'll do I'm trying to figure out where I'm gonna move to um, I feel like well here, here's there's a couple of things um, I feel like I want to move here uh, buy out this so that I can play around with this piece of property here on, on the side of the road um, to have the freedom, I guess, to do that. Um, but also, I want to slowly work my way up, believe it or not, up here so I can put a bridge probably right over here uh, to get across the water this way instead of going all the way around. I have to make it shorter. And um, I think we'll put in our own bridge there. And then we'll have this is a, be a big open field, like one probably well i don't know if it'll be one field but um we certainly can if we want to lots of trees here we'll probably take all of these down probably some of these i don't know if we'll do them all so it's kind of a weird way to expand to go up instead of sorry i'm turning i'm, I'm having a snack while i'm doing this i shouldn't do that um yeah, so probably one of these would be preference. But I think I'm going to go here, here, then here. Put in a road all the way through with a little bridge here. Thinking about it still. Let me know what you think. Okay. All right, guys. I think that's going to be it for this episode. I've got uh, some more tree cutting to do. I am going to do a bunch of this off camera. Um, I don't think you guys want to watch me cut tree after tree after tree manually and load it. But we're going to thin all this stuff out. I'm going to load up as much wood as I can, sell a few loads probably. And then, uh, whoops, I forgot to set the time. But it doesn't matter. Um, and then we'll, uh, we'll see where we are. Uh, more milk. But it's still early in the morning, so we'll be we'll be in this in this month on the next episode. All right, thanks for watching. If you're enjoying this, please consider subscribing, and uh, I hope you guys have a great day.